Welcome to another quick little video and today what I wanted to do was share with you some insight on our uh, butterfly course that we're just releasing and what I wanted to do today was something a little bit different. I have Fabio who's been my coaching and mentoring student uh, over the last little bit. We've worked on iron condors in the past and now he's actually working on butterflies. So he's got about a month in on butterflies and I just wanted to give you another perspective from someone who's kind of just recently done it and have been doing butterflies a little bit at a time um, to give you some insight on how difficult it is to kind of get started with butterflies and just maybe a perspective of how he sets one up or how uh, you know the difficulty levels of him setting one up uh, is and of course he's kind of new so uh, it, it's, it's a starting point for you to see that after if you're brand brand new after a little bit of time you'll be able to kind of do this on your own of course there's always a slow learning process but that's the point of getting into it just like riding a bike at first you know you're falling down a little bit and then you keep getting better and better so anyways here's our little quick little uh, video but before we get there uh, here's kind of some insight on the butterfly um, course uh, we're gonna go ahead and release it August uh, 31st we're gonna release the first introduction parts of videos then you'll get more into the Greeks then we're gonna get more into uh, kind of uh, the volatilities of planning a trade out, uh, adjusting trade ideas, and um, putting on butterflies based on the VIX. And then we'll get into strategy ideas and some example trades, like such as we start the trade 46 days out, and then we kind of go backwards, 45, 42, 40, and how the trade is doing. And then we'll do another set of trades there. So check that course out. You can go to our website at rise, the number two, L-E-A-R-N.com. And you can also uh, see those kinds of things also on our uh, Traders Fly website. It'll be right at the top uh, on the home page there. When you scroll down, you'll see butterfly spreads. And of course, for getting the butterfly course early during the kind of promotion or early bird uh, time frame, you get a little bit of a discount. And if you record a video testimonial, if you've purchased a past course, um, you know, or a past book, you can do a video testimonial on that and receive another $50. Uh, towards your purchase. So here it is. Enjoy the video with me and Fabio. Today we're going to take a look at and cover a couple of things on the butterflies and I just wanted you to see how difficult it is to learn and here I have Fabio uh, who I worked with one-on-one -on -one for coaching and mentoring uh, over the last few months so far and he's just been doing butterflies recently over the last uh, month or so and I wanted you to get a different person's perspective on how difficult it is to learn butterflies. So um, can you give some of the people out there a little insight on how the process was to learn butterflies? Was it extremely difficult? Was it kind of easy, medium level, or kind of what are the struggles you kind of had with it? Oh, well, actually it was easy, mainly because I was learning Ari Conner before. And that gave me an idea, the foundation about the uh, options. But butterfly was an easy concept to understand. And, you know, uh, what, what was easy to understand the, the idea about butterfly strategy. And, and why did it make it easy for the transition from the iron condors to the butterflies? How are they kind of related and how did it make it fit for you? Because the iron condor gave me the foundation about the strategy and options, about delta, probability of touching, and all the things I start to use by using uh, butterfly strategies. Okay. So, yeah. All right. So we've, I've shared with you, uh, you know, because with the mentoring people, I always give them uh, the courses even ahead of time as I'm filming them and doing modules and modules I think that could help. So you've got some insight to uh, the course even before it was released and some of the videos, what would you say as far as those course materials, how helpful were they for uh, learning the butterfly spread rather than you know scavenging some things on YouTube because I know you did some things on YouTube there as well. Mm -hmm. How was that beneficial relative to the other uh, videos? So the course video gave me a nice specific idea about how to build a butterfly. So I didn't know exactly how to do, just watching sometimes YouTube videos, but the course video gave me specifically how I built the butterfly strategies. 
So about the, how I need to follow about Delta and you know how I choose my strike prices and that all together gave me you know a specific idea about how to to build the butterfly strategy all right so can you give people some insight on the way that you build out uh, your butterfly if you don't mind can you go ahead and show people on screen like the way that you do it now and how easy it is for you to kind of do it i know at the beginning you probably struggled a little bit um but now you know it's a little bit easier for you to do it so uh, go ahead, if you, if you don't mind, um, can you, you show should, them? Yeah, should I do one with neutral uh, one or you directional? Like, what, whichever one you kind of like to do and, and, you know, some insight on. Uh, or both, know, maybe? Yeah, well, just, just show one and just that okay. way you can see, hey, how, how you do it and, and what are the types of trades you've kind of been doing. So that way we can just get an insight. All right. Because you've only been doing this about a month right yeah. so about a month so uh that first few days was it a little bit it was a little bit of a struggle right it probably took you what 30 minutes to put on one butterfly right maybe an hour i don't know yeah 35 30 45 minutes to to one and as you do and as you practice and uh, having a foundation about the course you just start to do faster afterwards yeah Okay, so now how long does it, well, let's see how long it takes you to put on a basic butterfly. We'll just do it on a paper platform and you can just so set one up maybe. Let, let me share the video here. Uh, butterfly. I entered the ticket here, the symbol. And then if I want to do at around 36 days, it's considered pretty much a short term or 29 days. 36 is better. Um, I come up, come here and I see at the money that would be between these two uh, points. And I change the color. So at the money, I choose this one and I click with the right uh, bottom of the mouse, buy and butterfly. After that, I need to check um, around 20 to 30 delta. I would say, you know, 28 delta is 250. So come back here, 250. Sasha, I think I will change this. <laughs> <laughs> 250 then. Yeah, I think I'll change this strategy or you, or cause like if I choose 250. Yeah. What's wrong with 250? Nothing. I just need to, <laughs> just need to put in here, huh? <laughs> exactly. You got it. All right. So 250, 230, 250. And then I need to do the same thing here. So 250 to 30 is 20. So I come here and give 210. So I have 10 to 10 and 50 there even and equal. After that, I analyze my trade. Uh, so let's see, uh, because I have butterfly here, I have Microsoft maybe. Okay, so I just unclick the ones that I had and then click here. So that gives me an idea about a neutral butterfly. I don't have directions here. I will make my money mainly considering Theta. Um, and, and that it is. So that's Easy. my butterfly no directional. E Easy setup, not too bad. Well, can you sh sh show that Microsoft butterfly? What do you have there? So, you know, that took a couple minutes, you know, at the beginning, obviously you're trying to figure out and learn which one do I click this and that. So this one doesn't take too long, but go ahead. Uh, why don't you take a look at that other Microsoft one that you already have going? Cause that so one's been up for a little bit. One, I think. It's, it's already, let's see. I know that's um, iron, iron condor. condor. Okay. So it's not an iron butterfly. Okay. So it's an no. iron condor one. Yeah. Okay. Not a problem. Okay. So yeah. So the butterfly trade, you know, doesn't take too too long to go ahead and set up and construct and you know after about a month you, you kind of get the hang of it and so on are there any kind of 
tips that you would recommend for other people to, before they do these butterflies or recommendations of things to learn or watch out for as they're learning it? Because you just you just did this. You're just basically still actually going through it and learning more and more of the butterfly trades. So um, any kind of last minute tips or, or words so for the I butterflies? Would say butterfly, as I saw over the course, gives you the power of directional direction. So I like to use sometimes, um, you know, if I see the stock is going to explode or a few times we could say for earnings once in a while, I could use Butterfly to give me some extra profits if I'm considering that the stock is going to rise or drop. So what I like about Butterfly is that also I can use in the same time, I can use for no directional as one that I did you now. And I can give some, if the stock is going to explode and that I have a good feeling about that, I can build another type of butterfly, I would say, a different strategy, I just changing the deltas and build a directional butterfly. Yeah, well, yeah, absolutely. The butterfly is very cost effective for for direction and quick theta, if especially because you got you're selling right at the money if you're doing kind of a theta based trade. So, mm -hmm. cool. yes. Well, thanks for uh, sharing and thanks for your time. I just wanted people to just kind of see, you know, somebody else a month into it of the butterflies, <laughs> just to how you could construct one and that you know you can get a little more familiar with it after a little bit of time. And um, I, I appreciate your your time. Yeah. Right? Many times, slash any time I'm here. All right, so there you go. I hope you got some insight there. Um, and you can see, you know, just the process of putting on a butterfly trade. And once you're a month into it, it's not that difficult. Uh, it, yes, you do have to check a few things. And as he mentioned, there are some struggles at the beginning. Uh, but um, after you do it, you know, five, ten times, you'll get the hang of it and you'll start putting more and more of these on a little bit easier. And you might sometimes say, hey, I wanna do a balanced one or an unbalanced one, and that's gonna be just a personal perspective. So check out our website there for the Butterfly course, um, and then you can go ahead and click the links here once they are live and active. Right now, as I'm recording this video, they're not, but by the time you watch this video, they probably will be. And uh, then you can go ahead and, and purchase this course and get it kind of at an early bird uh, discount. So that's at our website there at uh, tradersfly.com. And then that'll redirect you to our um, uh, Rise to Learn website, which is where we have all our courses. So this, uh, this, this course is detailed. It's in depth. It's got a lot to offer, especially those of you that are brand new to trading options. There's a lot of insight here. So anyways, thank you so much for joining me. Feel free to grab a few other freebies that I have by clicking the link here. Um, or subscribing to the channel if you're new or checking out some other videos. And of course, look in the description to get some more insight to those links as well. Thanks again, and I will see you next time.